All right, craziest thing happened. So, good morning. Morning. So, we got these pineapples, right? Got these pineapples in like a week and a half ago, two weeks maybe. Maybe a week and a half ago. And somebody bought. We have like four left. We had five left yesterday. Six left yesterday. And so this couple comes in. They buy two pineapples. Then, like an hour after they leave, they message us and they go. Um, so we bought this pineapple from you, and there's a lizard in it. Like, what? So I asked him to send me a picture. So, check this out. Well, whatever, I won't show you the photo, but... So we got him, we've collected him. There the little guy is, hanging out. Where? Oh, he's coming out now, he is. Anyway, there he is, hanging out in there. And so, um... With the magic of the internet, we asked our Facebook followers um, if anybody had a lizard tank. And somebody dropped off a terrarium for us. <laughs> so now we have a terrarium with a little heat pad on the bottom. And uh, I actually had went last night with some friends and picked up this exact terrarium from the pet store. It cost 80 bucks or something and it's in the trunk of my car right now. And then after I picked it up, this lady messaged us and she was like, Hey, I have one that you guys can have. So thank you so much, Maxine. Big shout out to you for giving uh, little Georgie here um, a new home. So anyway, we got this little cute lizard. I think he's in an anoli, maybe? Do you guys know? Also, we'll get some good footage here once we get him into his new home. But um, we're going to plant this up with some dirt. We're going to plant it up with some tropical plants from the greenhouse. And... Uh, Let's make a terrarium. All right, so we're uh, we're trying to figure out which plants we want to put in here, um, based on what plants we have in the greenhouse. Um, so we've got this styrofoam back in here that we may or may not keep. We got it filled up with some nice tropical mix, um, really well draining. <clears throat> and then um, I've been we've been finding some plants here, and so we're we're having discrepancies already, Lorraine and I. She's trying to put like um, dragon tree, um, like a big dracaena. Uh, she's trying to put crotons and bromeliads in there. Um, the bromeliad, when you put it in, like you put it there and it was like literally too tall and literally too wide. The leaves were like curling against the glass. But we're, we're arguing about it because she wants to put them in there and then when they outgrow it, she wants to take them out and put a new one in. And I'm kind of thinking we should probably try and find plants that are the proper size now that won't outgrow the terrarium. And so I'm finding things like this little fancy peperomia. Um, we also have like another peperomia here that still stays relatively small. And then we have some baby tears that would be good, good ground cover. Um, so we're just uh, trying to discuss that now and figure out what what we can put in here that we'll both be happy. <laughs> Chris and Chan are here. They came to help. Maybe they'll be the voice of reason between the two of us. Okay, we got her filled up. What do you guys think? We got um, a little tiny um, fantasy. Uh, I think it's a peperomia. And then we got a ribbon plant, and we're throwing in some baby tears. What uh, What did you guys find? Oh, you didn't find the... Oh, there it is, that yeah. One? What do you guys think about that one? That might be good, but this one's nice too for in here. Oh yeah, hey. Okay. Nice and green too. It's not like we need to act for the camera, just having it on would just be... Oh, like... Okay, there's that. This one's kind of cute. He's little. Actually, there's two right there. How big is that actually going to be in here? Well, pretty tall, because, like, like, he'll be like that tall. That's a good size. Yeah, we don't so already have to trim him almost. What about this yeah. guy? I really don't mind having to cut the top of a fancy area. No. We're gonna see if we can get this guy to fit in here. <laughs> this is a family channel. Okay. <laughs> oh, there we go. Finally. Check it out. That's actually a lot of new growth on those roots. Yeah. They used to be tiny. Okay, which one do we want? Oh, they've been six pack there. Okay, do we want this one? 
That one's actually really cute. And he's gonna be like three inches lower than that, so that's pretty good. Then there's this one. Meh. Okay, and then there's this one. I already don't like it. <laughs> I like this one the most. The really big one? Yeah. Especially if we put him like, like that. Yeah. Alright, that's the one. Yeah. Oh wait, let's let's imagine it with a cutoff leaf. Like I think I like the, I, I think we should cut this leaf off. No. Yeah. Like imagine that without this leaf, and we'll cut it right down to the base so it won't even look ugly. Okay. And it'll be like a nice open cone. You better properly. Okay, that is like the number one. Have you? Oh, I gotta show you. So the comments on like my video where I like cut a whole bunch of succulents down to nothing. Mm -hmm. The comments are like shitting on me hard. Oh, I bet. Because they're like you had really popular or really like full grow and beautiful and now look at them they're just gross and I'm like and then they were like upset about all the leaves I was but you away. should do an update on they're, like they were like you you should have grown all those leaves that you threw away I'm like I can't grow every leaf we like, could I have, I have but one like, plant and I'm like make, keeping one plant like but everyone treats it like you're like committing murder you are when you throw away a leaf you are Okay, what do you think of that? How's that look? That's cute. Yeah. Right? I think so cute. I think you'll be happy with this. We're putting in so much effort for this little lizard. Yeah, Georgie. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys think? He's Make a give us a, a suggestion Gregory. for a name. You guys are gonna you guys are gonna see the little cutie here in a second when we put him in here. He's a Gregory. Okay, so now we wanna put this guy in here. We're thinking way up here. Well, are we still gonna put that other thing in? Here? What other thing? That, that tiki thing? thing? Yeah. I don't know. What do you think? I'm okay without it, really, but. Yeah. I've never been a fan of like gimmicky things in my things, but. Well, let's just leave it out now, and then if Mom I'm wants to put it in. I'm not the child of fairy gardens, because if she wants to put it in, it can go right here. Yeah. And it'll look yeah, super I'm busy. Yeah, much happier without it. Yeah. Purposely right, Sorry, Lorraine. Let's make room here and then get our lizard. Or should we water it first? Probably water it first. Are you going to put down that stuff you bought? What stuff? The ground cover. Oh shit, I forgot about that. Mm. Yeah. Oh, Sean. Ah. Well, that's another leave it on there. Oh. All right. Come take a look before we cover it with mulch. What do you think? Pretty cool. And then these, when you get too tall, you just oh. cut them and stop from growing. And then the only thing that's going to really outgrow this place is maybe this guy. Because this guy stays like six inches tall. You guys stay low. This guy, we actually look <laughs> We tried to look it up, but we can't figure it out. We'll deal with that as it comes. You like it? Yep. Happy. Um, there's a little heating pad under there. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait, right. we need to find a home for the water dish, though. Or, like, just back here. Yeah, that's probably where it is. Mine. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Mm -hmm. She was unhappy about that. She 
well, that's because I get carried away, man. I'm like, I'm like, I want this, like, I want to get this really cool, like, fish tank, and then three months later, it's covered in algae, and half the fish are dead. Like, I'm not really the most. I get an idea, and I can run with it, but then I don't really follow through. Yeah. I'm like, I want to collect two thousand dollar Hawartheas, and then like a week later, I'm like, never mind. I want all the San Severias. I like this one in there. I know you like it, but it looks much like a sun just like Huh, I think it looks good, but go ahead and change it if you don't like yes, it. Yes, we put it no, it looks better down like that. Okay. Want me to help? I can I can push I can push the glue onto the plant and then you can dab it. Oh yeah. Just enough? Yep. You ready? So we're not hurting yeah, nothing. I have one. Oh yeah, for sure. Okay. Oh yeah. Imagine this. Imagine you're sitting outside and the sun's beating down on you and you're in a, you know, you're in a glass cube. I would and it's never got a mesh be top. in that. Just imagine this. Because I die. Just imagine this situation. I would die. <laughs> <laughs> I would never put myself in that situation. You gotta put your smoke pants on. <laughs> Don't jump, sweetheart. Georgie. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> He's so small. I told you. <laughs> He's gonna get out. He's so cute. Look, baby's like, oh my god. <sighs> Why are they doing this to me? All right, let's put a fly in there. You're just gonna hand bomb it? Yeah, that's what I do every time. Chris, please tell me you got that. I hope that. you got that on camera. You didn't. Shit. Chris. <laughs> Keep it on him. Just that face would have been awesome in slow-mo. <laughs> it's fucking fly. God damn it. <laughs> okay, there's always like a hundred flies here and now there's like one. <laughs> Good morning, Brady Gardens. Oh yes, we do. We have four inch, six inch, and and big. Yep. Awesome. We'll see you. Yeah. Bye. So how are you going to do Well, yeah, I'm just gonna take his wings off. Dude. There's one wing. Can we take off the other legs? Hey guys. Hello. And then we'll drop him in. There. Like right in front of him. He's like. Eh. Ooh, it is right in front of him. He's staring at it. It's gonna be way too big for him, though. He ate the other one. Maybe. You think? Mm -hmm. He's staring at it. He's thinking about life. Want some magic trick? Square beak? Not square beak. <laughs> Cute hat. He looks a baby, whatever he is. That's a cute hat. <laughs> Alright, there we go. What do you guys think of our new terrarium? It's hanging out at the top. We got a nice Talanzia in here. We got a ribbon plant. We got two peperomias. Some baby's breath and then a little snake plant that we separated and planted in there. 
So uh, we'll see. We're just trying to get his humidity and his temperature up. And he's happy. So uh, let us know what you think his name should be in the comments below. And uh, we think we have a name for him. We really like George or Georgie. Gregory. She likes Gregory. Gregory. She thinks he's Kate. Are you totally serious though? Yeah. With no Gregory. with no sense of a joke at all, you think that you think that he feels like a Gregory. Yes. I don't know. He's not a Georgie. I think he's a Georgie. No man, he's a Gregory. He's like a no. Watch it be a girl. <laughs> Gregina. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he's a little cutie though, whoever he is. So anyway, let us know in the comments what you guys think his name should be, and uh, we'll watch him grow together. Oh my god. Okay, so I know there's a lot of crazy stuff going on today, but look who's here. You guys don't know her yet, but you're about to meet her. So her name's Amy, and so she's the winner of the big tree. Yeah! So are you stoked? I'm extremely excited. Yeah, so this tree's like 21 years old, and out of 1,300 people, out of 1,300 people, she was one of, you entered like five, ten times? Yeah. Something like that. Yeah, how are you? So she's here to pick it up. So she's getting her uh, giant tree. You look good next to it. It's like Thank you guys... Thank you. Uh, compliments me. Yeah, it compliments you. <laughs> How old are you, Amy? I am 22. Holy shit, it's the same age as you. There you go. It's like 20, 21 years old, and she's 22, so that's pretty cool. Anyway, congratulations. Thank you. All right, and this little guy's hanging out on top of the screen, and I gotta go mowing, so I'm getting this stuff all loaded up. All right, let's go mow. Okay, you guys, so he's been in there all day. He's been in there all day. All the customers have loved him so far, and... Uh, and everyone's been okay with the name Georgie, so I don't know what you guys think, but uh, that seems to be the popular popular name. We got a little Kalanzia up there, it's kind of nice. Also we got his humidity up to 80%. All of a sudden this is going to be a lizard channel instead of a plant channel. <laughs> um, I don't know, like, should I show you guys plants? You guys probably come here for plants, don't you? Uh, it was pretty exciting giving away that jade today, that's pretty cool that it finally found a new home. But um, there's some things we're starting to sell out of here. Like we're starting to run out of uh, peace lilies, curly leaf figs, button ferns are all gone. Um, yeah, so green pear plants again are almost gone. That's like gonna be the third tray we've went through. Um, so we're gonna have to start getting in some more things here to try and fill this place up. So luckily we have three more orders coming in the next two weeks. And uh, yeah, so hopefully that stuff will arrive soon next week because I don't wanna go the whole week running low on product. Um, a lot of first timers are coming out though, so that's cool. A lot of people are calling us being like, hey, where are you located? We're on our way. We need some houseplants. So it's exciting to be um, getting new people out for something like houseplant season. Uh, that's pretty cool. So uh, anyway, we'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys for watching. And um, if you guys kind of like whatever, like what's going on here, uh, give this video a thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you're new here. And we'll see you next time. Bye.